And we start with some late breaking news this noon. The search for a murder suspect in Corpus Christi, leading officers all the way here to Atascosa County. That chase coming to a deadly end. Officials telling us that there was a shootout between a suspect and three officers. It ended with that suspect dying. Our Camelia Juarez is live at the scene and has details. That's right. It's a very active scene. Take a look behind me. You can see that they're still investigating. And like you said, the suspect in this case was shot. Uh, Atascosa Sheriff David Soward says the suspect was shot once. Two deputies and a district attorney investigator shot at him and they were not in. Uh, not injured. Take a look at the aftermath of this shootout. Sheriff Soward says the suspect was a murder suspect in Corpus Christi. Atascosa District Attorney investigators saw the suspect coming up northbound Interstate 37 and tried to pull him over. Officials say the suspect refused to stop, so he sped off at 85 miles per hour. Authorities believe he began shooting a rifle outside of his Ford pickup truck while cars were passing by. No one was hurt. The chase ended when DPS laid out spikes that would deflate the suspect's truck or struck tires. Once the truck stopped, the suspect put on a protective vest and began firing his rifle at deputies. Deputies returned fire when the suspect was ultimately shot and killed. We know the suspect was wanted for a murder in Corpus Christi and police were working on an arrest warrant. Now we're still waiting to learn the name of that suspect. Right now we know that the Texas Rangers are leading this investigation and if you're in the area, you may want to avoid Interstate 37 because there is obviously this investigation going on. Reporting live in Atascosa, Camelia Juarez, KSAT 12 News.